Hello, my name is Grace Logan Stevens. I am eight years old and I live in a small village called Staveley in the English Lake District. As you can see, this is the rainy season. I am here today to find out a little bit more about what the people in Staveley are making and doing to prepare for the future. To help me discover more about the people who live and work in Savy, I've called in local top reporter, Finn Garrity. Can you please introduce yourself and tell us what you do? My name is Robin Cousins. I'm one of the brewers here at Hawks of Brewery, one of the leading brewers in the country. Where does your business fit into the community in Stavely? Well, it's a great social hub. Lots of people come out, come out not, not just to drink our ale, or come into the mill, mill yard itself to look round. When they do come in here, they'll have something to eat. Great place to chat. We use all local food where possible. We use the local butchers, uh, the coffee. There's a coffee shop at the bottom of the mill yard. We use that. The, the bread we use is from the artisan bakery next door. So we try to encourage and use as much products as we can from yeah. Stavely Village itself. Hopefully, you know, Hawk, Hawkshead uh, employs local people. Yeah. There's a lot of people in this village, youngsters. It's, it does get harder and harder to find a job and they do have to move away sometimes. So we will try and employ as many yeah. of these people as we can. Now we've learned all about f food and drink, especially beer. Let's find out how Stavely builds a local economy. This is the Big Onion where all the people from Stavely can sell what they've grown and made. A healthy economy is really important for a strong community. The things in this shop have all come from places in and around the village, like this. By growing and selling locally, the people of Stavely are helping to save the environment. They are also supporting local producers, which means everybody wins. Now I'm going to call it a taxi for my next appointment. I'm not sure the taxi driver really knew where he was going. Can you tell us who you are and what you do? I'm sure I can. I'm Will Ackland. I'm co-owner of Waters and Ackland Furniture Workshop in Staveley here. And we design and make fine furniture, but we also teach others how to do it. Can you tell us the history of your business? Yeah, it was founded in 2007 by myself and Oliver, 10 years ago now. So back then it was just the two of us, um, and since then we've employed four of us over okay. the years. Where your business fit into the community in Staveley? Well, the heritage of woodcraft in Staveley and the manufacturing of the bobbin mill originally on this site. Oh, a, yeah, we have a connection with that because we are furniture makers, of course, predominantly working in wood. But with our training, we also bring in international students. Um, and so they definitely add to the economy of the village. Mm -hmm. And a big part of keeping Staveley interesting and, and vibrant. Yeah. What do you think is the most important thing for young people growing up in Staveley? That's very interesting. Um, I think the continuation of working opportunities and the diversity of working opportunities that are available for young people in Staveley currently, the continuation of that would be, is very important. Little did Finn know that Will was about to turn the tables on him. What is your favourite thing about Staveley? This is good. So there we go. Our investigation has revealed that Stavely is a vibrant community that is full of people making and doing. As long as there are businesses like this, and 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 this. Then Stavely will be making and doing for many years to come and we can grow up to live 
and work in a happy, healthy community. This is Grace Lagan Stevens and Finn Garrity signing off. Bye!